Hey guys, I took everything here from GumballTech.com and JohnsIphone.com and we're taking a look at the very nice theme today which was sent to me for free to review for you guys. It's a theme review and this is called iBlueWorks HD and I do not know how to pronounce the developer's name but the developer's name would be bottom, the bottom over here. Go follow him on Twitter. It's a very awesome theme creator. And I'd like to thank him so my highest appreciation for sending me this theme for free to review for you guys. So let's get started on the lock screen. Let's go in. Lock screen first. Lock screen is a very nice lock screen, as you can see. And it's a very nice, easy setup as well. That's what I was about to say. And um, all it takes is just two uh, themes to be activated, and boom, you get this. You don't have to set up anything unless you want to change your city. And uh, this is the lock screen. You, you can see you do need a lock screen clock. I lock to hide your clock um because this has a a built-in a uh, clock system right there and um also comes with a nice mini calendar there it tells you the day the date the year and the month looks very nice and uh the background looks very similar as well very very gorgeous nice to look at when you want to look at your lock screen anytime and then look at the bottom gives you a nice weather widget there sorry about that Nice weather widget, tells you degrees Celsius, your city, and tells you the kind of weather you're in. Also gives you a nice little icon there to represent the weather. Okay, you can change the city in iFile or via SSH. A very nice UI. I love the lock screen. Let's go ahead and jump into the passcode lock right now. You can see it's very gorgeous. Fantastic look. Um, passcode part is themed as well, and the buttons... The keypad, everything is themed. Where I enter my digits are also themed as well. It's a nice little bar right there. And the fonts are also built into the scheme. You can see when I press digit, it turns into a nice little bright color digit right there. Look at that. It turns brighter. Very nice. There are also UI sounds to this, which I'll get to in a second. Let's take a look at the home screen first. This is a very nice home screen. You can see the icons are made with such high detail. Let's go look at the status bar for a second. You can see the white the carrier um, bars are themed, the Wi-Fi bars. Um, status bar is themed as well, very nicely done. The um the nah, battery percentage is themed as well as the battery. I don't I do not have the battery showing right now, but I know it's themed. Definitely for sure. Let's take a look at the icons now. Very gorgeous icons, guys. The folder icons match the, the custom icons that the developer made. Love it. Absolutely gorgeous. Badges are also themed. Nice page dots at the bottom. Also the dock as well. Very nice. There's also a widget to this. This is the home screen widget. There's only one widget. Although it looks very gorgeous. Gives you the, the month over there, the year. Nice candle like on the lock screen, looks very similar. Also, you can set your own um, wallpaper there. And as well as a nice weather widget. Um, nice divider there to separate the icons from the widget as well as the status bar. There's also a folder enhancer theme of this. Very nice folder enhancer. It's a tweak that allows you to put as many icons as you want in any folders. So go ahead and check that out in to complete this theme, very nice theme. And that's basically the home screen, the lock screen, guys. Let's go ahead and take a look at the next part of this theme. Now I'm going to demonstrate some of the UI sounds in this. You can see there's a nice HUD controller there, steam as well. I boost it up to the max. Let's go ahead and take a look when you lock your iPhone and the sound it makes. Sounds pretty weird, eh? But 
it's nice and the, it's nice that the developer added some UI sounds to this compared to some other themes where the developer didn't add some UI sounds so another one when you're on law there are many different UI sounds to this which uh, you which, uh, we'll probably see later on as we get through more of the theme and uh, it's basically the UI sounds and let's, let's take a look at the next part of this theme now we'll be taking a look at the media section take a look at the iPod there is a custom icon to that as well very nice this is the loading screen for most of the apps and as you can see the UI in this theme is very nice matches the whole theme itself the blue um, top bar the bottom bar the UI graphic elements gorgeous artists songs let's take a look at the now playing section look at the button gorgeous this is the best, one of the best iPod players I've seen so far. I love it. I'm sure you guys will too. You can see on the top, all the icons are themed from the list, the back, as well as the time slider, as well as the volume slider, and the play, the previous, the forward button. But the airplay button is not themed, that's pretty sad. And um, wallpaper, if, you, if you're, uh, let's say your song doesn't have a custom artwork, this is the artwork you get. Matches iBlue Works. You can see there's a nice iBlue Works logo right there. Very nice. So list. It's also a theme as well. There's a nice wallpaper behind it. Very nice. Songs. That's basically the iPod app. Take a look at the YouTube app. There is a uh, Custom loading screen and custom icon as well. Let's take a look at some of my videos here. Pay attention to the UI. You can see it's very nice. Um, that's the loading kind of circle there. Take a look at my latest video. This is the media player for the videos. You can see that's the loading icon again. Very nice. Everything is themed. Zoom out a little bit. Right there, everything is themed very nicely done. The done button, the full screen button, the previous play forward, the volume slider, the time sliders. The only thing that's not themed is history, mail, and airplay. It was not really a big deal, but yeah, that's basically the media player for the videos. And let's take a look at the next part of this theme. Now we will be taking a look at the messages app. Sorry about that. There is a loading screen to this. It's just that I didn't. I launched it before, so it, there's no loading screen right now. And um, you can see that the UI is very nice. Edit, compose, settings, all themed. Let's take a look at one of the messages here. Um, um, right here. Very nice messages app. I love it. You can see that indicators tell you whether it's sent by you or sent by the person you're texting. And um, all the UI and graphic elements are themed very nicely done. Camera button, the send button, um, the wallpaper, very gorgeous, fantastic work. And um, that's basically the messages app. Not much to cover in this. And let's take a look at the next part of this theme. Now we'll be taking a look at some of the default apps by Apple. Take a look at the calendar here. No custom loading screen to that. This is the iBlueWorks calendar. Very nice. Everything is themed. Calendars, the top bar, the buttons. Nice bottom bar there. As well as the calendar itself. Let's another app. Photos. There's a custom loading screen of this. Top bar, bottom bar, nice UI again. And uh, it's a very nice camera roll here, as well as a nice UI at the bottom. Just the photos. Let's take a look at the notes app. I'm guessing the notes are blue. Nice. 
that was right the notes are blue you can see very nice my notes when it's in landscape mode it changes to eye blue works when it's in portrait mode very nice right there ui bars theme as well let's take a look at the notes here very nice the bottom there are custom note there are custom icons for the notes as well the mail the trash the forward and the previous note button notes very gorgeous let's go ahead and take a one more app take a look at one more app which is the phone app custom loading screen as well very nice you can see that the keypad is themed just like the passcode you saw on my lock screen um, UI contacts very nice and that's basically most of the default apps I showed you a while ago we do not have the time to show them all because there are just too many Apple apps and I'll probably be, I'll probably end this video in like 30 minutes if I have to cover all of them. So that's basically most of the Apple apps that a lot of people want to see. And uh, yeah, let's get to the next part of this theme. Next part of this theme is the UI. Let's take a look at Safari here. I already showed most of the UI a while ago in the other apps. You saw the top bars, the bottom bars, the loading screens. The um, You see the UI is very nice. Top the bottom bar and the top bar is very similar to the to the um, uh, uh, previous apps like I showed you, like the iPod app and stuff like that. Um, wallpaper is also like that, very nice UI. And the buttons look very similar to the to the other icons on the other um, things, on the other apps, yeah. Very nice. Page dots as well. Uh, let's take a look at the App Store. I can find it. Um, Right there. <laughs> Sorry about that. Kind of zoned out there a little bit. <laughs> All right, that's a loading icon. Nice graphic UI, and uh, the bottom bar looks very similar to the iPod app again, and the videos app. All this UI I already demonstrated in the previous app, so you shouldn't be shocked right now to see that that UI there as well. And that's basically all the UI there is to this theme. Let's go ahead and take a look at the next part. There is also an SP settings theme to this as well. Very nice SP settings. That's a, a very nice background as well. And the divider to separate the icons from your information. And uh, the icons are all the same. You can tell whether it's turned on and off, whether it's bright, and stuff like that. And nice indicators there. And uh, the more refresh dock with spring power button steam as well as well as some nice dividers separate the info from the icons as well. Subdividers, very nice SP settings. Matches the steam is all blue. Love it. Let's take a look at the next part of this theme. There is also a color keyboard theme to this as well, as well as eye access. I currently have color keyboard. It's larger with custom put custom themes on your keyboard. This is the eye blue works custom theme. Very nice. You can tell whether it's caps lock or not catch lock and all the all the letters are themed um, as well as the numbers the other extra icons very nicely done enter buttons theme as well as well as the space buttons a nice iBlueworks logo right there and the international logo as well there's also the iAccess keyboard this for those iAccess users out there um, just to let you know I do not have eye access, so I cannot demonstrate it to you guys because I think that app is a bit too expensive compared to what Color Keyboard does. Let's take a look, and let's take a look at the next part. Of this so that's basically my full overview of iBlueWorks HD. It's a very nice theme. I'll get to the price in a second. And um, just to confirm, I did not pirate this theme. Um, and please do not ask me questions regarding how to get this theme for free because I will not entertain you and I'm not a pirater. Uh, I used to be and I just changed from, I just changed the legit mode. And <laughs> so yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at the price. And this theme, iBlueWorks HD goes for $1 on the Cydia store. Yeah, $1. Can you believe that? What a deal, I'm serious, this is a very nice price for a very fantastic theme. You can see package officially purchased right there. Again, I thank the developer Glenn, 
Glenet's name. <laughs> it's a different Twitter username, so sorry about that. I got confused. And uh, thank you very much for sending me out this theme for free to review for you guys. This theme is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. And so guys, that's basically my full review of iBlueWorks HD. Again, if any questions regarding this theme, leave in the comments below or contact me on Twitter or contact I Guinea Glenn Glenn on Twitter. His Twitter name, his Twitter username will be over here. Um, yeah, follow me on Twitter as well at program hacker ninety two, and uh, subscribe to my channel for more theme reviews. I do a lot of theme reviews like this. I know I've not been doing theme reviews for a week. Sorry about that. I probably have theme reviews every week for you guys if you're a theme lover or eyes device lover and you just want to customize your eye device to its full potential. And again, uh, swing by my website at www.itecheverything.com um, www or http two dots, uh, semicolon, whatever, two backslashes, and itecheverything.com. And uh, that's basically it, guys. My full review of iBlueWorks HD. And I'll see you guys in the next one.